Hey guys, it's the Awesome Bro, and today we're going to be playing some more World of Warplanes. I actually really enjoyed playing last time, and it seemed like you guys did too, so I decided to play it again. In between the two episodes, I actually have done a lot. I've gotten uh, the idea of the game, like, much better, because last time it was just a day after I got the game. So, as you see, I have two new planes. This is the P-12, and I decided that the P-12 is my favorite plane between the P-12 and and the AR-68, is that, is, no, sorry, 65. And then, let's go to the tech tree. So the P-12 is the first fighter in the USA. And then I had a choice of going to the P-23, F-2F, or the P-26. I decided that I would go to the P-23 because uh, I like airspeed and maneuverability, and I thought the hits point, hit points were also pretty good. I upgraded everything fully, and it's a very, very good plane, and these are its stats. And now, I bought the plane after that, which is the Hawk 75M. And it has much more hit point, many more hit points, 131 hit points, altitude performance much higher, and firepower 67. It's a very, very good plane in general. Now, what I just need to do is to get the P-36 Hawk. Um, so, there's also this thing I learned called Elite Planes. So, as you see at the top here, there is experience, and you get the experience when you play a game. But you only get a lot of, usually you get about, like, not, not a lot of experience from a game. But if you play with an elite plane, then that means that you get more experience. And the elite plane is where you've maxed out all the upgrades and you've bought the plane after it. So, I really want to make the Hawk 75M elite and here's my chance i was i decided to do this on video i've upgraded everything fully as you see and now i just need to research and buy the p36 hawk this is also good because i can show you guys what and how this game actually works so let me just research this research it here we go an elite status acquired for 75 for the hawk 75m See, as you see here, elite status is given to the aircraft with all of the available modules and technical branches researched. Experience earned on elite aircraft can be converted to free experience, which is this stuff. So now I can purchase it using the money. I just want to know how much it actually costs. Oh, and it actually requires these things. I guess I can actually get these on camera. <laughs> Oops. But that's okay. I guess I'll just... Uh, see what I can do in between episodes, but at least now I have the Hawk, um, the Hawk, was it 75M? That is elite, and I'll play with both the P23 and the Hawk 75M today. So let's go to the hangar, and here's the P12, P23, I also got a paint job for it, and the Hawk 75M. These two are now elite. So first, I think that we will play with the P-23. It seems fitting to go from top to bottom, and I'll see you guys when I get into a game. Okay guys, so I've gotten into a battle, and now the battle starts in 25 seconds. That was actually the fastest I've gotten into a battle so far. It took me 12 seconds. So let's just compare our plane, the P-23, with the other attackers. It's also an attacker plane, if you didn't realize, not a multi-role. And this one's actually better, but I'm, I'm, oh, battle started but I'm better than the bulldog plane so let's skip the introduction scene and as you see the paint job at the front there is for USA and it doesn't come with that I got that so also I figured out how I also figured out how to uh, talk to the, the teammates by clicking the buttons F4 means uh, cover me and F7 also means SOS like clear my tail those are the really important ones oh I've just gone into bomber mode but those are the really important ones, and what I like to do is go up, up high. You can't really do that well with this plane, but I'll just tell my team to cover me using F4. And this plane is actually, like, its maneuverability is very good. So I've told them to cover me, and oh my god, there's a heavy fighter. How much health? One thing you'll realize is because I have a higher tier plane, I play with much harder battles. So instead of playing with all, like, P-23s and the starter planes, now they've matched me with these harder battles. And I don't want to die to this guy, so let me just try to get him. Another thing that these uh, better guys have is they have a gunner, 
like on the roof which is really annoying because even if you're uh, shooting them you still like die you still get, not die but not essentially die but you still get hurt which is kind of annoying I need to focus super hard on this guy oh, I will not give up on this guy okay oh somebody's shooting me who's shooting me oh okay let's now attack this guy I just needed to cool down my uh, shooting now let's attack this guy there we go his, his fire is absorbed onto the other teammate there we go and we have destroyed him so now they have three planes destroyed and we only have one which is pretty good this is a TSH 2 it has a lot of uh, health but now me and this guy will work together to kill this guy oh but you don't want to bump into the planes into those planes the TSH because they will just wreck you the moment you bump into them so let's get this guy now we can totally get this kill easy gains oh we assisted come on I totally thought oh somebody's uh, give me an SOS let's help this guy let's boost over and help him out oh yes over here I'm gonna just gonna tell the team to focus on this point because there are a lot of bad guys there anyone need help I'm gonna help that guy in the bottom I think so I'm just when you dive you get faster speeds so that is a trick to get fast Oh, you know what? No, I'm going to help this guy defeat him. Um, I'm just looking whoever needs help. That's what I like to do. Here, this guy's needed need in, of immediate help. So, let's try this guy. He also has 70-something health. I didn't see. So, it's good. It's not, it won't be too hard to take him out. Let's reduce my thrust to zero and kill him. Reducing your thrust to zero makes it so you can run after them without going in front of them. It actually helps a lot, and you press S to do it. It's kind of uh, logical. But now, who else should I help? Let's help this guy take down this TSH. And this guy's the bomb. Oh, I actually don't want to attack this guy that much. We Usually, usually the teams leave the TSH and all of those uh, type planes for later. Oh, someone's attacking me. Who is it? Oh, it's this attacker. I'm gonna help. I'm gonna say help because this guy has more maneuverability than me. Oh, but he has no health, so he's dead. Die. There we go. So I have three kills now. This this game is actually going pretty good. Uh oh, that attacker is on very low health. Somebody will surely fi finish him off. And let's see. There are two bad guys over here. So I'm gonna help this attacker out over here. No, there are four bad guys. And there are only five people remaining. Let's focus fire over here. I'm telling my team. And let's boost over there. We're arriving at the giant battle. This is a four on four battle, but now I've come to make our team better. Now it is a five on four battle. Let's get this guy under control. And it actually looks like these two have him under control. So let's get this TSH. TSH2. Oh my god, let's just dodge him away. Oh, I don't want to crash. Let's reduce our thrust to zero so we can run after this guy. Oh, he's surely, surely he's dead. I don't want to crash into him, no. Oh, thank god. If I crashed into him, that would have been me ended. Because it's... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I thought he was actually aiming towards me. He's just running away. These TSHs, I don't understand the point of them. Because they just run away all the time. They don't actually fight you. And they have one person left. And we've won. We've won this battle. And I had four kills. We did it, guys. Finally. There we go. I'm happy, actually, because we won that battle. So now we're going to play with the... First of all, let's see. How, we're going to play with the Hawk. 70, Hawk 75M. Now I've gotten 45, 49 XP. Um, some money. And that is good. These are all my, uh, what is this? Battle performance. Oh, this is people's battle. I thought those were my kills. Detailed report. I've never actually looked at this, but that's fine. And now let's play with the Hawk 75M. This plane is amazing. As you can see, it looks much better. Instead of having this open seat, now it's closed, which is much better. And it can go to high altitude, which I love. So let's get right into the game. 
Okay guys, so the battle is starting, and I'm looking at everything. These guys, uh, the heavy fighters, obviously they have more hit points and firepower, but I have more airspeed and maneuverability, much more, so that makes them easy to kill. But they also have the gunners on their roof, which is kind of annoying. Um, these, uh, oh, I don't know where they are, but those ones are upside down triangles. Y usually you have better maneuverability than them. Than them. The real ones you want to worry about are the multi-role fighters, ish, you want to worry about them. But also what you want to wor worry about is the other attackers. And I'm actually also an attacker, and I looked that I'm actually superior to two of the attackers, and the other one is actually better than me. But... That is because I'm in the Hawk 75M. It's amazing. Let's go through this bridge. I know I'm like splitting off from my team, but I will take on this guy single-handedly. I see this guy coming towards me, and I want I really want to come through here. Let's go. If I crash, I will cry. I will cry if I crash. Oh, yes, I did it, guys. Yes, I did it. I'm so proud of myself. Oh, my God, I almost crashed. But I'm super fast now, so now we can, oh my god, a lot of people, let's take on the, oh my god, let's call for an SOS, there are four people on me right now, oh my god, SOS, please help, I'm getting, I can get destroyed right now, okay, let's kill this guy, this guy's gonna get shrekt, absolutely shrekt, okay, 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 no, don't kill me, please. Somebody help, I'm calling for SOS. Some people just ignore the calls. I hate the people that just camp around. Super annoying. Let's use our altitude to our advantage. How somehow we actually have better maneuverability than this guy? I don't know how, but let's help out this guy. Oh, here we go, this is our chance. There, I hit him. That's good, I actually hit someone. Oh, this battle is not going very well. Oh, this guy is trying to hit me. There we go. I got some hits off. I've all actually only gotten four hit points down. So that is actually good. Oh, I rammed him. That's not good. Please don't crash. And a good thing to do is, though, if you have good control over your plane is to almost crash and then the person that has bad maneuverability will die because he'll crash and now this guy oh this guy is getting absolutely wrecked he has better maneuverability than him but i've destroyed him and now let's turn around i've actually cleared all the enemies in this area which i'm actually proud of myself whoa i actually haven't been here ever yet so this stuff looks actually really nice oh there's a heavy fighter here that has like no health so let's go and kill him and get the kill so I have one kill now oh he I think died but let's aim for these these guys there are plenty of people to kill right now plenty of people here we go oh this guy's getting wrecked that guy's we'll deal with him I'll help their tail I got their tail let's reduce our thrust to zero this guy's getting away now but we can come over this top use our boost oh no my engines overheated but we can still get a lot of hits on look at this pro skills oh i don't i just don't want people to steal my kills it's really annoying when people just steal your kills oh my god i hate that i hate when people just steal your kills but we've won that was the that was the easiest victory i've ever had i don't know why but it was the fastest victory and i think that maybe we'll have another uh, another round. Maybe with the P23. I'm not sure yet, but we'll see. You know what, well, guys? I've decided that that's actually going to be the end for this video. If you guys want to see more, be sure to leave a like. I'm Maybe I said this in the last video, but when you guys leave a like, it actually helps me to see what you guys like, obviously. So if you like this video... Tell me in the comments. Tell me that you want to see another one so I know to make another one. If you want to see a different game, tell me in the comments. Whatever you guys want me to do or whatever you want me to change, tell me in the comments and I'll do my best to accommodate. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe. See ya.